and wonderful beyond our wildest expectations. Just a few weeks ago, we heard one of the most historically significant buildings in Vancouver was on the brink of closing. But now, thanks to an outpouring of community support, it appears the old Hastings Mill Store Museum may have been saved after all. It was at the point where we really thought we were going to have to close. Due to the pandemic, the museum stopped receiving visitors and an annual grant from the city essentially got stuck in limbo as the municipal budget also felt the squeeze of COVID-19. This after the museum just finished investing in capital projects like a new chimney and accessible fire escape. We were um, considering how are we were going to keep the building open and keep the artifacts from getting condensation on them. We've got an amazing collection in here. There's so many antiquities, so many uh, indigenous belongings with all the stories and um, it's got a very promising future now. Lisa says since the news broke that the museum was in trouble, they've received phone calls and emails with more support than they could have imagined. She says people have been coming in to make donations and they've nearly reached their target of $40,000 through a GoFundMe campaign. The word's really gotten out. A lot of people seem to have adopted the cause. People just seem to have really been captivated by the spirit of Hastings Mill and the history. In case you didn't know, the Hastings Mill Store Museum is the city's oldest building still standing. It survived the Great Fire and was moved later in its life by barge thanks to a group of local women who sought to preserve it. In the meantime, Lisa says the door remains open and she's optimistic the city will come through with a grant. There's always lots to be done with a, a building of this age. Well, the whole situation sounds pretty exciting then, eh? Yeah, we're absolutely thrilled. We're feeling very positive about the future, and, and we really just want to thank everyone so much for coming to our aid when we needed it so badly. And um, Vancouver, you've really come through. In Vancouver, David Zura, City News.